Hello everybody, welcome to season three of Northwest Wing Shooters. I uh, just want you all to know I appreciate you watching. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. Um, I really do enjoy making them. A little bit delayed in the uh, process this year. Um, my laptop was stolen over the summer and uh, just now was able to finally bite the bullet and replace that laptop. <laughs> So we're back to making more videos for y'all to watch and I really hope you enjoy them. If you do, please hit the like button and uh, do subscribe to the channel. That'll definitely help me um, get the word out there as I'm sure you've seen that, uh, noticed on the channel that there's uh, ads on there now. And um, I don't make a lot of money doing it, but it definitely helps, especially when I have to uh, replace the computers that I use for editing. Hope you enjoy this first video. This first video is, uh, grouse hunting out here in Idaho. I'm out here quail hunting today, um, but uh, that'll be for a different video. Just wanted to uh, thank you guys for watching the channel and uh, welcome you to season three. Hope you enjoy the video. Thank you. Hello everybody. Welcome back to Northwest Wing Shooters. I'm out here with Jake and the dog. We're out in the grouse woods of Idaho. It's October. We actually just saw a rough grouse on our drive-in and flushed it off the road so we're gonna go see if we can get it in the air over the dogs we'll see you guys out in the field This is kind of where I remember it being. There's a cow in there. Kind of a. It probably flew into one of these trees. It looks pretty low. Where? Did you hear it? I thought I heard it. Gypsy just put a bird up into a tree right off the road. Okay. You want to go over there? Yeah, I'll go check it out. I don't know. There it goes. Where'd he go? It flew into one another tree straight across the road. I think she's right under it, Jake. Like straight in. Jake? I think it's up here somewhere. Like somewhere between me and you, but further in. I think I shot it. I think I. I think I hit it. I thought it was closer to you. Does she have it? Nice. The first Idaho grouse is a rough grouse. We're pretty sure this is the one we saw on the road, isn't it, Jake? Yeah. It looks like good habitat, though. So maybe we'll keep hunting this area a little bit. One down and seven to go. Seven to go. <laughs> Cooper's on point right here. He is. Cooper, whoa. Get the easy. There it goes. I think Gyps bumped it. Gypsy, come on. She's on point now. Good boy, Coop. I don't know where it went. I heard it. Good boy, Cooper. Good find, buddy. Dude, these woods are full of grouse. It's all good. I'm sure Dizzy will bump her fair share of birds today, too. I know. It's just a little frustrating. It sounded like it went straight this way. Yeah. Maybe we'll bump it out of one of these trees, Jake. It could have gone that way, I suppose, or that way. 
I guess all I really know is it didn't come back towards us. Really happy with Dizzy's confidence. She's doing great. Kind of the plan for this year is to just let her go. I don't want to overtrain her. Good girl, Dizzy. Good girl. Should we just try to rendezvous at the pin for the other spot and then uh, go hunt through all that and then work those draws down and come back up to the truck? Good girl, Dizzy. Good girl. We're gonna have to train our dogs to back this off season. Yeah. At least Dizzy. Cooper's too far gone, I think, at this point. I think that was the thing that I was really the most about. Gypsy's been trained. To honor? He normally uses, he usually backs really well. We got a Diz and a Gyps up there, and Cooper's up here. No, he's in front of us. They're all up here. Mm -hmm. Huh? What? Hi. There it goes. There goes one, up into that tree. Which tree? It's a blue grouse. There goes one. We gonna find it though? That's yeah. the question. Diz! Gypsy! Hey, dead bird, Gypsy! Gyps! Oh, I can hear it flopping. We need to get down there before it dies. Gyps! Come on, find it, dead bird. You should hear it. Coop, Cooper, dead bird. Yes, yes. We'll find it with three dogs. Right? Oh, we have to. It folded pretty good, didn't it? Yeah. Catch it up. Come on, go, go. She's got it. She's got it. Nice. That's a blue, isn't it? Oh, it's a blue. Dizzy, leave it. Dizzy. Oh, buddy. It's a stud. Good girl, baby. You're fine, huh? Man. Your turn. <laughs> did you just not, were you, did I beat you to it or what happened? I, uh, you know, I just didn't know if I had a shot. Oh. I'm still really, real, I, I don't know, I just, I'm not used to shooting through cover. Big old blue. In the bag. I gotta get yeah, you do. It's your turn. There it goes. It just went up in that tree. It's right in this second one, straight in front of us. I'm gonna let you get in there. I'm gonna back you up though. Yeah, maybe we should try to come at it away from the sun. Yeah, I'm trying to get up here. Can you get us in this tree right here? Yeah, I think so. About halfway up. Holy, there's a ton of birds up here. I think this is about where we were when she found that one last time. Yeah. Oh, there she is up there. She's uphill from you. It's definitely tough going, but this is where they like to be, I think. Seems thicker than I remember it.
thing probably didn't hold for it because it was just out here in the open again. I have no idea what, what direction it went. It went that way. Straight away from her. She, I saw her chasing it when it flushed. It went that way. Well, now do we go chase it or do we stay? Or water. <laughs> Let's chase it. Oh. I didn't have a shot at it. I did see where it went though. That was a different bird. I mean, I saw where, I think I see where this one landed. So we could both go after this one and then go that way. Sure. You wanna take the lead? I've already got two birds. Sure. It's like, even if it isn't there, you're not gonna find it. Just gotta wait it out and hope it flies like the other ones. So it would have flown this way. Yeah. Who knows how far back though. I want to say that that last flush we heard was from behind us. That's what it felt like. So I don't think it's the same bird. But. I would just be ready if we walk under the right tree. Right. Huh. I think there's a little dusting area down here, Jake. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Cooper Swizzly Cooper's on point. Yeah. He is. Ninety six feet. Gypsy's right here. Cooper's up here. He looks like he might be moving again. No, he's still on point. 68 feet. Did he? Did he wolf? Wolf. Oh yeah, he's on a hard lock. He's moving now. Must be running from him. Let's see if he can find it again. Well, be ready. It could be anywhere in here. Where the hell did this thing go? Here's a feather. There's a grouse feather. There's a spring right there. See it? Yeah. No, I just found a rough feather right here. Cooper's birdie. Definitely. 
was or is something nearby. Gypsy's looking pretty birdie down in the bottom here. There's gotta be birds around here somewhere. Right? Well, we got water and feathers. Cooper's moving super slow. What's Dizzy doing? Or, I mean, Gypsy. Is she on point? Yeah. Cooper's really birdie right here. He had the he had it um, pointed from quite a ways to ways away. There's a good wind coming from that direction. Good boy, dead bird. Touch it up. Good boy, Coop. Bring it here, bud. Come on. Come on. Here. Bring it here. Come on. Here. Come on. Out of buddy. Oh, you're tired, huh? Yeah, you got him. Good boy. Oh, you're done. Okay. You worked your ass off for that one, bud. All right, well, after a morning in the grouse woods here in Idaho, we're, we just got back to the truck, taking a little break. We might go hunt again, we might not. We'll see. Dogs are pretty tired. And, and Gypsy. Gypsy put in some good work today. She retrieved two of the birds that I shot. And she put a lot in the air too. She's got a nose for them, that's for sure. Um, but anyway, yeah, I just got back to camp. Worked up an appetite all morning, so uh, we're eating some of these these Pioneer Pies hand pies that really hit the spot after uh, a long uh, morning in the grouse woods. I just warm them up on the barbecue, wrap them in tin foil. This one is uh, steak and cheese. That love and goodness. Anyways, uh, we'll see you guys uh, next time. Dead bird. Huh? What's that? Yeah, right next to the left side of that tree, right? I think he might have it. This one just flew right past me. I could have killed it. Came in out of right here. Really? Oh, he's got it. Good boy, Coop. Come here, buddy. Yeah, one just flushed right here, Robert, right behind you. Good boy. There was a whole cubby of them sitting right here. Yeah. It's a rough. Good boy, leave it. Nice. Yeah, beautiful. One rough grouse down. That was quick. I think one of them landed in this tree right here. 
I'm not gonna have a shot though. There, Dizzy just flushed it. Okay. One just got, one just got up off the ground. It must have hopped back down onto the ground. Hey, Dad. D why don't you come? Why don't you try to find a trail to come down here? Okay. If you walk back the way we came a little way, it seems like there was a game trail there. Holy I'm telling you, there, there must be holding right here. Right along here. It's too bad you don't have a gun. <laughs> I know, damn it. I could have had two already. Uh, Where did that one that just flushed go? If I'm facing you, my right, or if I'm facing away, the right? Facing away. Okay. I'm gonna start walking that way. If you go back down the road, I think there's a game trail over there somewhere. Okay. Cooper was on point while I was on the phone. Yeah, I believe it. So at least I killed the bird, one of the birds. Yeah. You know, I almost like this more than chucker hunting, honestly. The last time I hunted here, I found ground all over this hillside. They eat those little white berries. It feels good to get a bird right off the bat. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, I missed, completely missed on the first, but hit it on the second. That's that seven and a half steel that we bought. Oh yeah, it's perfect for them. Yeah. Cheap, Yeah. That's the job. Yeah. You don't blow them up. Good girl, Diz. No bird. Good girl. Good girl. Flew on the other side of the trees. Boy, I really like the way you guys are hunting today, though. Good dogs. It's crazy that we got into so many right off the bat. I know, it's too bad we weren't ready for it. What's the limit on I don't think I hit that bird. Shot through the tree where I thought it would be. Did I ring your ears? No. Okay. Here went another one. Dizzy's bumping them over there. I got I got to go after this one. I never saw it come out the other side. No, I didn't either. Yeah. 
nasty thorn. I didn't hear it hit the ground. I didn't hear it flapping. I didn't either. It's got to be in here somewhere. You know? He's on point right here. Maybe I did hit it. He just went on point right here. Oh, I did hit it. Good boy, Coop. Yeah. Good boy. <laughs> shot that through the trees <laughs> yeah i was gonna say there's, there's no reason why that shot won't penetrate through that stuff nice yeah very nice Dizzy went right through there. Okay. There it goes. I think Dizzy Dizzy bumped it. Good girl, no bird. She's doing awesome. She's hunting on her own and she's going out and, you know what I mean? She's doing great. Good girl, Dizzy. All right, everybody. Well, hope you enjoyed watching this Idaho forest grouse video. And if you did, uh, Please hit the like button. That'll help me out and subscribe if you haven't already. We got a lot of uh, awesome videos planned for this year, this season. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy them. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.